Ever wanted to see the different campsites at Lake Murray State Park? If so, you won't want to miss this one. I'm not real sure why the date isn't showing right, but it's actually October 13th, 2019. Yeah, this first little part where I'm at here is Duke's Forest campground. This is a really pretty area. Hmm, not real sure of the RV site gosh, but for the regular primitive type, the dry camping, no electricity or water, is uh, now $16 a night. But there's a lot of hiking, fishing, playgrounds for kids, uh, actually pretty clean restrooms with showers there's, there's a lot to do and the ground is fairly level so if you're into bicycling and not an extremist it's pretty easy biking Now we're kind of moving over into the uh, tent site area, or the primitive camping, however you want to refer to it as. No water or electricity, but there is fresh water available back up towards the uh, RV area. And it's a really nice area. Coming up on your right is where I was standing at. Didn't have any neighbors. And a nice little hiking slash bicycle trail down behind me. Back ways, not uh, too close. I wanted to adventure off the pavement to uh, take this little dirt road and uh, show y'all what you will see if you go down this little dirt road. This road has not been uh, graded in a while, so unless you have a little bit of ground clearance, it might be a little rough. I certainly wouldn't be driving a vehicle like a Corvette or anything like that down this road, that's for sure. Yep, there definitely is water around this camp area. Really pretty water too. Now these roads get kind of narrow and a little bit rougher too. But uh, it is definitely a secluded area, I will say that. I'm going to speed things up a little bit to make it look uh, a little more interesting. So hold on tight. We made it. Alright, on to the next campground.
sky. If you want to see Elephant Rock, Cedar Cove, and Tips Point Campground, be sure and be watching for the next video. So uh, keep on keeping on, and I'll see y'all on down the road. Bye.